What does wait until mean in Jenkins? Here's today's starting point. I have a Jenkins LTS controller version 2.387.3. I've also created a sample job on this controller. Now, before we take a look at that job, let's go review the documentation for wait until. And what wait until does is it waits for a condition to be true. And we can see that here, it runs its body repeatedly until it returns true. If it returns false, it waits a while and tries again. So what does this mean? Well, basically it means that any failures will slow down the delay up to a maximum of 15 seconds. Basically, it's just doing a back off from the retries. There's no limit to the number of retries, but if the body throws an error, then that causes a failure. Well, notice here that there are two parameters that we can pass into the step. Both are optional. Number one, it sets the initial recurrence period. So what we're doing is waiting for the very first time to run this. By default, it's 250 milliseconds. We'll see in our example that we're setting it for a bit longer than that. And then also you can set quiet. And what this does is it does not log a message each time the condition is checked. I always want that to be logged for my job. So we're going to ignore quiet when we do the setup. Okay, now that we've reviewed the documentation for wait until, let's go take a look at our job. So we'll go to dashboard, wait until, and click on configure. What we'll see here is that we have a three stage pipeline. First stage, we're just echoing out hello from the shell prompt. The next, we're gonna do a wait until. Notice that we have set the initial recurrence period to 5,000, that's five seconds. Also notice that we don't have quiet set. So that means every time wait until runs, we're gonna see that logged out to the console log. And we're gonna see if a file exists. We're looking for a file called testfile.txt. What will happen is that will continue to run until that file is found. And then finally, once we find the file, we're just going to cat out the contents of that file. So let's click on save and click on build now. When we take a look at the log file, we see our hello. Then we see that we're checking for file exist and we keep on retrying. We started out at five seconds, then we went to six, then 7.2, and eventually that's going to cap out at 15 seconds. So the check will happen every 15 seconds after that. So let's go ahead and go into the agent where this job is running. We'll check inside of the workspace. We'll see wait until. So I'm going to CD into the wait until because that's the name of the job that I have. And then let's go ahead and we're just going to echo in hello world into testfile.txt. Now watching the job underneath, we can see that it found the file, echoed out hello world, and then the job completed. If you have any questions or comments, you can reach out to us on Twitter at CloudBees. If this video was helpful to you, give us a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to CloudBees TV yet, why not? Take a moment, click on that subscribe button, and then ring that bell, and you'll be notified anytime there's new content available on CloudBees TV. Thanks for watching, and we will see you in the next video.